Well, when I first learned about the massacre, the first thing that came out of my mouth was, that's impossible. Israel is so strong, so blessed. They belong to God. I could not imagine that anyone had the capacity to invade and to inflict the hellish anguish we all witnessed. We were in utter shock, complete disbelief. And I recall trying to view some of the images of what was happening, some of the videos, and it was just too much to take in. We had to turn our eyes because we could not physically take in what these people were going through. And so it was too much to view for some of us then. And yet now, a year later, the world has viewed it so much that we have become so desensitized to the horror, the evil, the sheer evil that we watched on October 7th and the sheer evil that so many hostages are still enduring every hour of every day, every minute of every hour, every second of every minute. We, we have forgotten. And we've, we've been pushed out of the cocoon of never, never again to yet again. Yeah. Yet again, here we are. Here we are. Yet again. We cannot be silent. We cannot sit still, get up and be a voice for Israel in this hour. Christians, it is our responsibility.